The Variables button allows you to view and manage the current test's variables and create and use new variables. When you click the Variables button, you'll see four options. The View option allows you to see all the variables of this test, which at the start include things like login info and the app URL, taken from the plan this test is associated with. You'll see sections for test-generated variables and data-driven variables. The Manage option allows you to manage the variables that come from your test, which can be variables added in during test creation or through associating the test with a data table for data-driven testing. You're also able to add variables here. The Create option lets you create a new variable for the test. When you create variables, you can choose where to set the value from, whether that be a string template which you can customize with randomly generated characters in the pattern box, a property of an element on the page, a JavaScript snippet, a Mabel mailbox address, or data from a data table associated with the test. You will have to give the variable a name, then you can add the variable to the test. The Use option lets you use any variables in the test as an input value for an element on the page, or as a URL for the test to visit in a step. The next button is Find Elements, and we'll cover it in the next video.